hello lovelies welcome back to my channel it's carol here once again and in today's video i'll be showing you how to make your fruity brightening body butter if you're a nigerian or you live in nigeria you would know that this is hamatan season and body butter should be your best friend so for you to have a glowing supple and hydrated skin you need a nice body butter in your bag at all times so please ride with us while i show you how to make your best body butter so please if you've not subscribed to our channel please do well to subscribe like and share our videos to friends and families and also do not forget to turn on your post notification bell so you'll be notified every time we post a new video without further ado let's go to our workstation bye Hey, welcome guys to my workstation so for today's video i will show you how to make your fruity brightening body butter suitable for adults and kiddies so the main ingredients i'll be using for my body butter are fruits like i make my mango pineapple tomato turmeric carrot puree and i leave it in my freezer so it's actually defrosting that's why i won't show you guys but when it's defrost I'll show you guys so yeah um i'll be using for it to give us an emulsified feel i'll be using e-wax i also use a uh, hibiscus water like i love to use hibiscus water in my um body butter i'll be using my cocoa butter my cocoa butter i'll be using my shea butter I'll be using my mango butter. I'll be using my orange infused oil. Like this has been infusing for over, you can even see the color is totally out. But I like to leave my orange infused. It's been infusing for over two months now. My propylene glycol my coconut oil, glycerin, my preservative because it's fruity so preservative is needed, my strawberry perfume, almond oil, vitamin E oil, oh yeah this is hyaluronic acid and then my calendula essential oil okay yeah and this is for the major oil i'll be using this is an infused oil infused by me you can even see the remnants of different herbs and fruits infused together like i have different i think up to 11 or 12 oils here these are nice career oils okay guys and um before we start i have been you have to sanitize your instrument when you want to work so here everything i'll be using from my measurement cup to my spoons and plates and my mixing bowl it's been sanitized in hot water so guys please always take notes for you to start any formulation and for it to give you desired results always sanitize your tools sorry my hand is kind of wrinkled i just came in contact with caustic soda so guys let's um check on our fruit we'll be back okay so um i'll be using i'll be measuring one quarter cup of my diy glow oil into uh melted butter and oils i'll put in measurements of everything i use from the e-wax to the butters and the oils in the subscription session So guys, um, this butter is your best bet this season. Seriously, like already in Amatan season. So for you to avoid having that scaly feel on your skin. And for some people that have um, sensitive skin, the skin begins to itch. It is best you have this body butter in your home for yourself and for your children. I'll also be measuring one quarter cup of glycerin into... Uh, melted oils i actually did not um 
put in my DIY glow oil into the um, butter to melt because I needed the full benefit of every carrier oils infused in it in the body butter so guys this is an emulsifying body butter seriously like the reason why i made it emulsifying is because this season there's so much dust on the road and for it to um, prevent dust from being attracted to your skin we need a wax to at least emulsify it it will like go into your skin and since um glycerin is also a humectant it will just help your skin absorb the butter into your um into your body so yes this is my fruits this fruit my god like different fruits blended in mango carrot pawpaw tomato juice turmeric just name it and please note i had to boil my fruit i had to boil it to make sure there was no gem locking in on hiding somewhere there and i used 200 ml of my fruit juice i didn't use everything i used 200 ml so here i'm going to be mixing it up a little with my blender then i will put it in the fridge okay so that's it um for the water phase now moving on to the powder phase i'll just give explanations i used sandalwood powder two tablespoons of sandalwood powder i sieved it i made sure it was really smooth i used one tablespoon of allantoin powder one tablespoon of vitamin c one and a half tablespoon of vitamin c one tablespoon of niacinamide that is um vitamin d i also use one and a half tablespoon of brown licorice powder or licorice powder yeah okay oh, okay here there yeah, my butter is solidified this is i think after like an hour or so this is me mixing it sorry my camera keeps messing up i didn't even know that i did not record the point where i was putting in my powders i've put in my powders already into this whole butter sorry my light is not really i don't know it wasn't focusing it was even too bright i don't know which one but please guys please endeavor to use to make this body butter Oh, I didn't uh, mention that I also used two tablespoons of lemon juice and one tablespoon of Irish potato juice. Irish potato is very good for lightening the skin. It's a nice, a natural lightener. I added um, Irish potato extract. So this is me. everything is well incorporated yeah and i added um one teaspoon of vitamin e yes that's my vitamin e going in and then next i put in my hyaluronic acid this hyaluronic acid is looking that way because i dissolved mine with i have the powder hyaluronic acid and i used my hibiscus water to dissolve it Forget English, please. It's zobo water. I use my zobo water to dissolve it. That's why my hyaluronic acid had that color. I added 10 drops of calendula essential oil, half tablespoon of strawberry fragrance. My fragrance anytime, in fact, my go-to fragrance is strawberry. I added that and I also added one tablespoon of propylene glycol. We need everything well penetrated into the skin so that's me just mixing everything incorporating it well into our butter yeah that's pretty much that okay guys um for benefits of those i would like to know hyaluronic acid makes the skin very healthy and supple that's why hyaluronic acid allantoin prevents dryness and irritation of the skin and it also gives the skin a soothing and calming effect sandalwood i'm just explaining this so 
everybody will know the benefit of everything that was used sandalwood powder promotes skin health like makes your skin very healthy it prevents suntan and um, pigmentation also brown licorice brown licorice is also an anti-inflammatory agent it helps to promote skin lightening and reduces hyperpigmentation that's it um hyaluronic acid also minimizes fine lines and wrinkles seriously it protects the sun the skin against sun damage now this is me putting this tube i'm putting is called hydrocortisone cream i didn't just buy this cream my doctor recommended it because my son's skin is very sensitive and is always prone to itching hydrocortisone is anti-itching it helps to um it helps to stop skin irritation that's why i always incorporate it into their body butter now i'm also using this 3k cream it's also an anti-inflammatory antifungal it's half i please note i do not put one full tube i make sure i use one tube twice in every of their body butter and please for benefit of doubt their body butter lasts for over two months so it's not something i use over and over and over and over so we use like one tube for like six months that's it so that's why i i added hydrocortisone into this body butter that's pretty much everything i use please do not forget preservative i also added preservative because in as much as this is a body butter we used our water phase was mainly fruit extract so for your body butter to not why not to just go it may not go stale but for benefit of doubt add your preservative so that it can come out nice and you can use any fragrance of your choice for me strawberry is my go-to this is our body butter looking so much like vanilla ice cream ready for the skin ready for the skin please guys subscribe to our channel like our videos share our videos to friends and families and please everything you see here is something you can do from the comfort of your home so guys i hope this video was beneficial to someone out there please if you found this video helpful please do well to subscribe to our channel like and share our video to friends and family also recommend our videos to friends like if you know anyone with a dry skin you can recommend our video to friends and also if you practice this at home please do well to tag us to your posts and to your pictures okay guys until next time bye